I'm vlogging. Video of the bug. We used it. No, I'm too scared. Yes, I <laughs> In case it summons the ghosts of Christmas past. Lovely. Nice brew. Go watch. <laughs> Hello everyone and welcome back to another YouTube video. So I am currently in Northern Ireland. I was going to film getting on the plane, but I feel like that's boring and everyone knows the process of <laughs> going to a different country. So I thought I would skip to the part where I'm actually here and the place where I am staying. So my parents are from Northern Ireland and we used to come here a lot whenever we were little and my mum has a friend who lives kind of in the sticks and has lots of horses. It's a really impressive, beautiful house and we are basically lucky enough to stay in the wing of the house. And as you can see, even by the bed, like it's just, it's so old money. A little bit eccentric, um, but yeah, very wonderful. And I'm staying here with my friend Ellie. So we've been here for a couple of days already. And the first couple of days we kind of just chilled and there's a kitchen here. So we've just been cooking our own food. We went out yesterday to see my aunt and my great aunt. But yeah, so today we are heading off to Belfast to the city center and it's raining a little bit miserable. I have hired a car. So we're gonna drive into the city center and we're doing a taxi tour. So it's basically from someone who is local and who knows a lot of the history of the troubles that went on in Northern Ireland. And obviously my parents grew up through those troubles. So I'm super interested in finding more out about that. My parents have done it and they said that even though you can probably hear Ellie in the background. Even though they grew up here, they learnt so much. So I'm excited for that. We're driving in, meeting them there. And then after, we are gonna go for some food in the city centre, so that should be good. I don't wanna, I feel like I'm talking without full stops today. <laughs> like all of my sentences are kind of merging into one. But, full stop, oh no, comma. <laughs> I haven't wanted to wear makeup while I've been away. And if you have watched my previous YouTube videos, you know that I have been having issues with my skin coming off the pill, but at the moment, it's so good. Like I don't have any makeup on at the moment, so I'm super happy. I've just, I don't have any active breakouts. I just kind of have scarring left behind from before. So we're staying makeup free. We're just wearing comfy clothes, really. Tomorrow we're going to, no, not tomorrow, the day after we're going to Dublin. We're planning to visit the North Coast, so I'll bring you along with me. So every morning I have been waking up and making an effort to do some journaling. And one of my goals over the next few years is I would love to write a second book. So if you didn't know, I published a book I think I was like 24, 25. Anyway, a lot of the views in the book, I currently don't agree with a lot of the stuff. And so what I wanna do at some point is review it for a YouTube video. But I also would like to write another book talking about, I guess my story, but an updated version basically. So I've been journaling just some notes so that I can kind of, I guess, think of what I wanna put in the book. Anyway, look at this view that I've been looking at whilst I've been writing. I've been waking up in the morning and looking out at as I've been writing and actually a, I saw a pheasant this morning, just out there. But I wasn't quick enough to get a video. So because we are just a couple of girlies, last night we saw a spider running across the floor and so now he's trapped in a cage and every time I walk past I feel really bad so I think I'll pluck up the courage and release him into the garden at some point. We also went for pizza last night and I am automatically in the habit of saving half of my pizza every time. And the reason is, is because I actually prefer cold pizza in the morning 
I don't know if anyone else finds that weird, but that's what I'm going to have for my breakfast and I don't care. Quick break while he sees to the engine. <laughs> Oh, this is not a good angle. <clears throat> I just have to hold it. Hello everyone. I was going to pop you on my settee, but I don't think this angle is working. So I'm gonna kind of have to hold it up. I should really just get my tripod, but I'm being very lazy. So I am now back in my flat in Birmingham and I had the best time whilst I was away. As you get older, I think this sounds like so cheesy, but we like forget to laugh and like have fun. And you know, when you're in school and your friend like makes you laugh so much in class that your stomach is literally hurting and you're like, you can't breathe. I feel like I laughed so much like that over the whole week. And I just really enjoyed myself. It wasn't like a holiday where, um, obviously it's Northern Ireland where you would go sunbathing and um, exploring. We did explore, but I've been to a lot of the places before because obviously my family are from there. So it was just like a nice, fun girls trip away. And Ellie met a lot of my family, which was really cute. And yeah, just caught up with everyone. I think it's really important to make an effort to go. Um, my dad, says that it's me going back home but it's not really because I was born in Birmingham but um I think it's important to connect with family um because obviously life is short and um and whilst everyone's around um I'm and I didn't grow up with my cousins and aunts and uncles so I always try and make an effort to go back and get to know them more and find out more about my history but a few interesting things that we did so I have a, well, it's actually my mum's cousin. So she does tarot readings and me and Ellie, we went to get one and I'm always skeptical of stuff like that. So I was like, oh, I won't get one. Um, I'll watch Ellie get hers. And um, Ellie had her reading and I was like, oh my God, that's so accurate to what's going on in her life. Obviously I won't divulge any of that. Um, but I had mine and it was so accurate to what has been going on in my life and what is, currently happening so one of the things that she said was that i my chakras i don't really know what that means if anyone wants to clarify but she was like you are the most balanced you've ever been in your life and that is 100 percent true and she a lot of it was about dating which obviously i won't go into she said you've taken a break from dating haven't you to work on yourself and i was like yeah oh my god because i took a two-year break and then another card was the devil and she was like and you've recently cut the devil out of your life and the devil is drink and i was like oh my god <laughs> that's so true um so yeah so it was really positive and interesting and i am still skeptical yeah to some degree but um but it kind of just reassured me that everything is going the way that i want to in my life and I asked her the question about um so what I'm working towards career goal wise will I achieve it and she basically said that you've you're really good at manifesting and everything in your life you've manifested so far so of course you'll be able to do it this year and it was just really reassuring even if it's a load of I still felt like good about it um, so yeah, so now we're back in Birmingham. So one interesting change is that, so I usually film my classes there, but as I have mentioned previously, one of my goals for this year is just to make my coaching the best it can possibly be. So I have invested in a local studio that I'm gonna test for my classes today and hopefully just get better looking content. 
I'm really happy with how everything is with my business at the moment, but it's just those fine tuning details. So I'm trying to invest more time, more money into just making everything better. So that's what I'm planning to do today. Um, I think I'm gonna round this little vlog up um, and then I'm gonna, I think maybe for the next video, I'm gonna film a workout video because I haven't done that in a while. Um, it's either gonna be a workout video or <clears throat> I think I'm gonna talk about me quitting alcohol so let me know in the comments what you'd like to see but um but i hope that you're all good i hope that you enjoyed this video i've got something in my throat i hope i'm not getting ill i feel like i need to go and clear it but um but anyway i'll catch up with you soon goodbye